My name is uh, Mohammed Mustafa. I am a Microsoft MVP. I've been doing Dynamics since version 1.2, which is slightly more than 12 years now. Mm -hmm. um, I also have a Dynamics practice, which delivers Microsoft Dynamics to a number of customers and clients in a number of industries, but with a lot of focus around the property and housing market in the UK. Excellent. So how did you get started with business apps? I think like a few of us, um, I started with Microsoft Dynamics um, just by coincidence. I joined an organization which um, was a Microsoft partner and they were strongly advised by Microsoft to pick up this new product called Microsoft Dynamics or Microsoft CRM at the mm -hmm, time. Mm -hmm. And um, and they needed to kind of build a practice and, and start delivering it. So I joined them and I um, did some basic training and since then it's, um, it's been my focus of my career. So what profession other than dynamics would you like to be in? Public speaking. I know it sounds weird, but I actually do enjoy doing public speaking. Excellent. So what excites you about the future of dynamics? I think innovation. Innovation is definitely one of the biggest areas of dynamics, and this is all about leveraging Microsoft Azure, cognitive services, artificial intelligence, machine learning. And these are not just you know great names, but there are lots of features and benefits that you can bring, and tangible benefits that you can bring to your customers and to organizations using those um, innovations. So that is really exciting for me. Excellent. So if you could go anywhere in the world tomorrow, where would it be? California. California. Huh. You should be able to go home that way. <laughs> What's one thing people need to know about Dynamics 365? I think one thing that everyone needs to understand is that you do not have to do Dynamics projects over a period of 18 months and 24 months. Dynamics is a flexible product. You can always do it uh, or split the project into smaller phases and get lots of benefits quickly um, within your implementation without having to wait for a whole two years to get those benefits. Yeah, good. On a scale of 1 to 10, how where do you? I would like to think I'm on the lower scale, so maybe on the three um, mm -hmm. element, but some people might dis disagree with that. <laughs> <laughs> What's a common myth people have about Dynamics 365 implementations? I think the, the common myth is that um, because Dynamics is a flexible platform, anyone can go and customize it to the point that you can have unexperienced people who didn't deliver Dynamics before going around trying to uh, make their own changes. That usually you know, breaks dynamics and unless you've got the experience, you've got experienced people working with you, uh, I would highly recommend that you, you know, hire the experts. Yeah, agreed. What are you not good at? Cooking. Cooking. <laughs> Although I would love to be, but I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> so what's so great about being an MVP? I think there are so many great things about it. Number one is, is the MVP community, you know, lots of great guys and girls, lots of experts to learn from, to interact with, but also gives you a very strong connection with the Microsoft product team, which I felt since I've become an MVP. I, I had lots of contacts within Microsoft, but not that many within the product team. But since I've become an MVP, I've got a lot of um, interactions, regular, almost weekly interactions with the product team, learning about all the nice things that are coming in, in the future, which I can use and utilize for my customers.